all right everyone welcome back to the second episode of assassin's creed brotherhood let's continue our story so in the modern days uh, we reached monterey journey and now you are supposed to find a way to get in there um oh that was the the assassin's image that was showing us what to Follow do me. Desmond, that was pretty. Awesome. He didn't jump. It just felt natural. We can get in through here. Good job. We'll just wait up here then, shall we? Yeah, all alone with with massive targets painted on our backs. <laughs> Sean is just a, it's a he's a character. Why won't this turn on? It's great to be out of the animus. This isn't exactly my idea of a good time. Well, let me guess. You're more the embedded six type. What, Desmond? I know how to have fun. Oh, that's very convincing. Yeah, I'm convinced. Okay, okay. After we save the world, I'll show you. Wait, can I get that in writing? <laughs> we have light. All right, so. This what is the that? way they went out. I yeah, I was going to say. Run! Get out before he soldati gets you! Correte! Go! They escaped through here. What? Ezio and the villagers. After the attack, I can see them now. I know it's difficult, but try to compartmentalize, Desmond. Focus on the present. What if I can't stop the visions? How long before I start painting symbols on the walls? Don't joke about that. <laughs> Sixteen is dead. We're focusing on the present, okay? Great. It's stuck. I can get under there. Ready. Any chance you can lift that gate? Not unless you want me to end up like that skeleton. I'll find a way around. I can drop into the corridor below through here. Watch out for bats. Where? I meant in <laughs> case you see any. Remind me not to make you a lookout. Exactly. Desmond? There's more ghosts. I'm here, okay? Stay with me. Ezio! Did anything fall on you? No. Is Mother all right? Desmond, we can't climb this. How about you give me a boost? That's a bad idea. I could throw you into the air and you grab the ledge. Even worse. Follow me. How about this? What are you going to... <gasps> nice job. I aim to please. I wonder how old these tunnels are. Middle ages, probably. Luckily, the beams still hold our weight. After all this time in the Animus, I'm not so sure. Yeah, I didn't want to <laughs> say anything, but you're really getting fat. Ouch. I even told Rebecca to widen the Animus. Seriously? No. <laughs> Once more. Up we go. Ready. Are we there yet? There are these giant statues. You know, when I came here last... When Ezio came here. Yeah, I meant Ezio. I shouldn't put you through all this. It's not right. Hey, all joking aside, I'm having the time of my life. It's thanks to you. Just focus on where you're going, okay? 
this music the, that just happened in the background when the kind of multiple sounds converged onto one specific sound i love that i love that part the the harmony created is awesome oh we are going down and it's special in this game it's not there it was not there in any other game uh not first not third Where are we going? Hmm. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. So... Ah. I forgot this part. What do we need to do? Okay, now what? Which way do we... We need to go up, isn't it? Or should we... Yeah, there is nowhere to go up. Hmm. <laughs> we need to press something here after that. When did this become my job? If I pulled all the levers, then what would be left for you? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> nice a, try. That's a good Ready? logic. Found a switch! That opens that Something's door. Something's open! Come on. Ah. Glitched for a moment. Yeah, even after remastering and all I'm this, over here, but I can see a lever across the water. There are quite Great. a lot of git glitches in this game. Swim in a toilet. I've got this one. Okay, but how? Oh. Oh man, it's freezing! Stop whining! It's easy for you to say. You aren't swimming in medieval <laughs> toxic waste. Ugh. I smell terrible. You're exaggerating. Now what are we doing? Uh, we will we'll have to go up? <laughs> Remember, this is the time of your life. <laughs> yeah, are, yeah, yeah. You only said it. Ready? Go for it. Okay, release it. How come you don't have to get wet? Because you're here. Charming. Aren't I? Come on. I've got you. Thanks. Ezio! We are on the other side! Hurry! Got so Great, the bridge is out. We can't jump this. I have an idea. You'll have to help me. Stand at the edge and get ready. Ready. <sighs> Made it! Let me see. Oh, you go on ahead. I'll just stay here to die in the dark with the bats. <laughs> Jump 
Again, that music. Nice work. The bats will be disappointed. For now. Soldati, I have found an entrance. I'll wait here. Good. Let me just go and get that bridge down for you. Uh, I did the last one. And I'm sure that will be your last one. Ha ha. Very funny. So we'll have to go that way. No. We'll have to come from the other side. Got it. Thank you, Desmond. <laughs> it's the way she said she said that thank you, Desmond. I think intentionally. These two have a very nice relationship. Now it's my turn to even the score. There. Thanks. It's a start. Do your magic. Oh, okay. Come on, go down. Desmond also has that ability right now. In fact, yeah, in the last game he got it. Up you go. Thanks. We make a good team. Yep, we do. Okay. Come on, Desmond, let's go. Okay, I can see the we are here. Door. Ezio must have come back here way after the attack. But why? Desmond! Right. Let's open that door. So Ezio, if Ezio came back here, probably for the apple, because this is where they hid it, right? Could be. There's something here. Can you open the damn bookcase, Desmond? 14, 19, 14, 20, 14, 21. You guys did it. About bloody time. What's that? Looks like something Ezio left behind. There are numbers underneath it. 1419, 1420, and 1421. Maybe you should lie down for a bit. 
No, it's all right. I'm fine. Whoa! They really built this place to last. No signs of structural damage, no cell signal either. Should be safe to set up. Let's get the Animus down there. Okay, everything's good here. Sean, hide the van in town, and make sure you aren't followed. What? What is that smell? It's my clothes. They smell like you swam through a sewer. It was Lucy's idea. <laughs> it was Lucy's idea. Wait a second, guys. We need power down here. There's a line running nearby I can hook into, but the wattage is weak. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Anything else you two would like? You know, some caviar, perhaps? <laughs> Maybe you'd like me to, to knit you a lovely hat. No? Fine. Follow me. Juan is really grumpy. Look around Monte Regioni for circuit boxes. Rebecca's little doodahs, they'll reroute small amounts of electricity to the power line underneath the villa. Don't ask me how they work. If I understood that, I wouldn't be the fella hiding the van. Okay. So there is one here itself. We'll have to find f three more like this. Okay. I think we'll remain in... Uh, in this vision. Uh, we first want to check this ground before going out. I think there is one more here. Let me know if anything catches your eyes. Yeah, only you'll probably be watching this video one year later or even more and then ah there is something there see okay so we did this one Let's go through here and see if we find more. Um, we'll get lost in this area pretty quickly. Ah, there is one there. And there is a fourth one there. I think we found all four. <clears throat> Think about how it would be in modern days to visit a town like this which has such a strong history. In fact, people still live here because there are modern day cars. I'm back. Just in time. The sun's rising. Yes, it's booted. We're good to go. Did you miss me? No? No? Anyone? Anyone? No. Hello? Hello? Am I speaking out loud? Hello? Work, Alex. Let's get started. Okay, so this is where we go back to the world. But before we do that, let's talk to everyone. Do you have any clue about those numbers under the drawing? 1419, 1420, 1421. Maybe something to do with the Hundred Years' War. Or, or wait, in 1419, Pope Martin V arrived in Florence, right? He, he left for Rome in 1420, and that was the same year Brunelleschi began building the Duomo. And in 1421... Um, in 1421... Yeah, I'll have to do some more research, I think. So he has no idea, essentially. 
He didn't give us any information. What are we going to do about Abstergo? Wait it out. As soon as we find the apple, I get in contact with our other teams in Europe, but as far as Italy goes, we're on our own. It'd be nice to have some help from above. Our top assassins are busy gathering info about the Templar satellite launch. We've pinpointed several possible facilities in the US, China, and Russia, but there are no clear leads yet. You seem focused. I've been busy patching new systems into Baby here. She's only gonna get better. Is Desmond gonna be able to relive memories this time? As a matter of fact, he will. Okay, so they, they have a replay chapter now. Okay, let's get into the main game. As you may have noticed in the van, I've made some improvements to the Animus, and I've also patched in a new VR training program. Here you can show off all those flashy moves you picked up from your ancestors. Let me open one of the missions. My kill streak. And now I'm completely messing up. Hey, short kill streak, it said. You can access more VR missions through the Animus desktop. As you complete training sessions, I'll add additional challenges. To stop your subconscious from rejecting Ezio's later memories, you're gonna have to live them in the order his genome recorded them. Highlight sequence two for me, Desmond. Good, now select it and you're gonna see the memories inside. Once you've unlocked a memory by accessing this menu, you can relive it as many times as you want. But what if there are memories I just want to forget? Desmond, this is very important. <laughs> if you need to take a break, log out of the Animus. You can leave the machine whenever you like. I'm all set to go. Don't worry. One last thing. As you raise your synchronization by executing events the way Ezio lived them, you might even discover some repressed memories. Okay, let's get started. Select the first memory. Hey, we are going to Rome. Desmond, I've been looking at those gibberish five-digit codes from the end of Subject 16's files and... I seem to have discovered a remarkable coincidence. The codes correspond perfectly with coordinates inside the Animus. I've tagged the landmarks, pinpointed by the coordinates with eye icons in the database. Now, odds are you won't find anything there, but... Well, who knows? There will be more symbols there. Oh, someone rescued him. Calmatevi. The pain will end soon. Where have you brought me? Nowhere, Messere. A man left you here. Did he say anything? Only this. You are to meet Messer Machiavelli in front of the Mausoleo di Augusto. Let me help you get dressed. The same man who brought me here gave me these clothes? Si, Messere. He is ready. Roma, January 1500. 
Roma. Yes, or what is left of it since the Borgia came to power. And the mausoleo? Unfortunately, you cannot see it from here. How about from the top of that church? Yes, but the stairs up are closed. That should not be a problem. Vi ringrazio di tutto quello che avete fatto per me, buona donna. Addio. A wilderness of tigers. Find a doctor to do not draw below one health square. Ah, oh, we need to find a doctor. How do we go down? Uh, yeah, here. Come on. Oh, he won't run. I need to find the doctor. There he is. So it's not like that he was taken care of for very long time. He reached here, like someone brought him here on the same oh, day. He Salute. I require medicine. Ah, let me look. Someone your age cannot recover from a wound like this with medicine. Here is something to dull the pain. You will heal over time. Grazie. Four out of five doctors would suggest leeches, but they have not proven effective against such things. However, I can recommend several good colleagues around the city. Do you need anything else? Come be healed! Abbot Ugo has long been a nuffle of some... So, take the medicine, okay. All right. We do not have any money, so we cannot buy anything. Someone my age. <laughs> Someone, he really doesn't like the age remark. Imbecile. <laughs> hey, come on, move away. We do not have a single mind. Imbecile. <laughs> that was funny. All right, here we are sinking on the first tower and there will be hundreds of them in the whole game, I, I'm guessing. 24 only, really? Because this is a small game, yeah. Word has gone out that a peasant is resisting arrest. We will show him how things operate under the Borgia. Machiavelli can wait. <laughs> Tail the guards. Okay. <laughs> Break something, the idiot. Winning Grazio. So Borgia's uh, coming to the power, Rodrigo Borgia becoming uh, Pope has not worked well for Rome itself. How far they will go? Sacrificing himself for the good of 
You guys hear that voice in the background? Oh, let's see. <laughs> the game is trying to make make it additionally hunting when we are doing this simple task of following a group of people and remaining hidden. Okay, kill the guards. Okay. Until that porco defiled her. I wish he just killed her. I wish he just killed La Mia Mata. People who saw her grow up cheered when he spat on her. Smiles on their faces when her neck... I understand. How can you? My Livia was innocent. I have lost family to the rope. To treachery. Il Carnefice watches from his home on the hill above. He threatens to hang me if I cut her rope. Okay. Here when is our far essay. Take her down. I will deal with your carnefice. What kind of brutality is this? That even after killing her. Okay, how do we get up there? Okay, through here. Il Carnefice, we are coming for you. Okay. I don't see any... anyone. Nice work down there. Uh, not my best. What is <laughs> <laughs> That was easy enough. Now to fight these guys. Requiescat in pace. Requiescat in pace, you bastardo. Come on, dudes. How much time will you guys take? No, you guys are not going anywhere. At least, at least the ones I can. My brothers will Stronzo. Ah, Stronzo. Okay, let's uh, loot all of these guys. At least at the towards the beginning of the game when we don't have any money at all. Okay. Let's see one here. Let's give us some money. Okay. Awesome. Let's go. Oh, I see another... People are really being oppressed directly by Borgias.
Oh, here is Machiavelli. Ezio, what a surprise to see you here. I thought you had sent for me. Never. News of the villa attack has spread across the city. We were certain that you were dead. Not yet. I am still very much alive. The Borgia must not discover that you escaped them. Accompany Machiavelli through Rome encountering dangers along the way. Throw the Borgia captain into the scaffolding. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going Follow to me. do that. Take care not to draw any undue attention. When do I ever? You would be wise to purchase missing equipment. You will not live long in Roma without supplies. I have my blade. And the guards have their guns, courtesy of the Borgia. Fortunately, I can help you. Grazie. While you are in my debt, perhaps you will listen to reason. <laughs> as soon as I hear some, I will let you know. <laughs> Buy the stiletto and Roman spoilers at the black meat shop. Okay. Roman spoilers. And stiletto is a small weapon. Okay. Investments will keep it for later. Now you can survive the journey back to Firenze. Perhaps. But I'm not going to Firenze. Oh. There will be no peace until we rise up against the entire Borgia family and the Templars who serve them. I do not recall such brave talk at Monteriggione. How could I have known that they would find me so quickly? That they would kill Mario? Rodrigo surrounds himself with snakes and murders. Mm. Even his daughter Lucrezia has been sharpened into one of his most artful weapons. But she pales in comparison to the man behind the villa attack. He is ambitious, ruthless, and cruel beyond imagining. The laws of men mean nothing to him. He murdered his own brother to take power. He knows neither danger nor fatigue. Those who do not fall by his sword clamor to join his ranks. The powerful Orsini and Colonna families have been brought to kneel at his feet, and the King of France stands at his side. Give me his name. Cesare, head of the papal armies. What does he intend to do with his power? What drives the man? That I still do not know. But Ezio, Cesare has set his sights on all of Italia, and at this rate he will have it. Is that admiration I hear in your voice? He knows how to exercise his will. A rare virtue in the world today. And so many soldiers. Is he taking us into a red zone? Looks like he is. Should we not travel by horse? Roma is quite large. As Cesare's conquests in Romagna continue to succeed and the Borgia grow in power, they have taken desirable areas of the city for themselves. We cannot use the stables here. Oh, the will of the Borgia is law now? What are you implying, Ezio? Do not play dumb with me, Machiavelli. Do you have some kind of plan? I am improvising. Kill the Borgia captain, okay? Let's improvise. Where is the Borgia captain? Oh, he's under here. Oh. 
Okay, Brother Bojan kept he in the scaffolding. Where is scaffolding? Okay. Now we need to climb this tower. Oh, we need to just go back to Machiavelli. Let's do it. Just because you kill a few guards does not mean the people will grant access to the stables. You are right. We need to send a signal. Wait here. Okay. Spro Anyone else stands in our way, we'll just kill them. We don't care how big or small they are. Or if they are uh, shooting at us or or whatever they are using um, so this is the new mechanics in this game to free certain areas you'll have to um, remove it from both your power by killing the captain and also lighting basically destroying the tower it seems this table is now available for purchase after you Okay, purchase this table. Lead Machiavelli to the stable. Okay, let's purchase it. We we went there too fast. Okay. We get it for zero franc. That's awesome. Accompany Machiavelli to the Campido Glio. Don't lose any health. So there will be fighting, that means. As soon as we reach the end of this uh, this specific mission, then we'll end this episode. It's almost 50 minutes in, so this will take probably another five minutes. Pantheon, I icon. at opening wounds, Ezio. But can you also close them? I intend to heal the sickness, not treat its symptoms. Stop sparring with me. Fine, let us talk openly then. Rodrigo Borja's death would not have solved anything. I am inclined to disagree. Look at this city, the center of Borja and Templar rule. Killing one man will not change things. We need to take away the source of their power. Are you suggesting we appeal to the people? Maybe. Relying on the people is like building on the set. You are wrong. Our belief in humanity rests at the heart of the Assassin Brotherhood. <laughs> he must be from your inner circle. Go, get back what he has stolen. I will wait at the Campitolio. I am meeting a contact there. Give me back my money! Come back here! You won't go far. You won't outrun uh, Ezio. For I regret sparing your life. Okay. So let us go to the next point and then basically end this episode here. Um, let's see if any of the towers become. Oh, 
all these towers became available and how far do we have to go oh we are in roma um we'll have to go right here so at least these few towers we will uh will open up before starting the next mission so hopefully you guys are liking it if you did like it give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel i'll see you with the next episode game changer x out